Recently, we built this beast of a PC with so much expensive components and as you can see, there is no RGB lighting on this fan and there is no lighting on this fan too and some other components too. I think you are also facing this kind of a problem. So we are going to fix this in today's video with the help of this little device that I ordered from Amazon. So let's see how it works. So here's the packaging. Let's unbox it. And this wasn't that expensive too. It was about like six, seven hundred rupees to solve our issue. So here's the box. You can also check it out from the description below. So here's the hub that I was talking about. This is going to help us in our situation. Rest we also get other components like a screwdriver and this cable to connect it to your motherboard. So let's go ahead and connect this thing and turn it on. So to connect this device, first we need to turn off our PC. Make sure to turn off the power supply too. Now we'll open this case. Let's remove this plastic sheet. So you can connect all the fans and RGBs here on this hub. The SATA port goes here and we have the ports to connect to your motherboard here. It also comes with double sided tape. So if you want to stick it to on your case, then you can do so just by peeling it from here and then just taking it. So you take this part off. Now we connect all the fans and RGB uh, cables to here. The SATA port goes here and we'll connect the included cable here and the other end to the motherboard. So here goes the SATA port. So let's connect the RGB headers. And let's connect the fan. So fan connects here. It's a little bit tricky, but you can do it. So let's connect all the fans and RGB headers. Now we'll connect the included cable. So this end goes here and the other end goes to your motherboard, one into the fan and other on the RGB board. After connecting everything, just do a quick test run to check if everything is working and then we are going to put this all together. So let's just see. Showtime. So as you can see, all the fans and RGB lightings are working and it's looking stunning. So this little device at about 670, 700 rupees on Amazon. Discount links are in the description below. Solved our biggest issue. It is kind of a generic version. If you would buy from Cooler Master or something else, it would be around two, three, four, five thousand rupees. I don't know, but this is very budget friendly. However, that's it for today. I hope this video helped you in some way or the other. So if it did, please make sure to give this video a like and you can also comment your thoughts down below. Make sure to subscribe to our channel for more videos like that. And I'll see you in the next one. Until then, stay safe. Bye-bye.